Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. In this video, I will show you another easier method to fix WhatsApp on your older devices running iOS 12, iOS 13, iOS 14. Because as you know, as of making this video, WhatsApp requires iOS 15.1 or higher. The method shared in this video is completely free and the sole purpose of this video is to make these older devices usable and it is for educational and informational purposes. Yes, as if you are following me since a long time, I already made a video on how to fix WhatsApp not working on iOS 12, 13, 14 and it was working just fine. But since one or two days, my viewers and subscribers are reporting that when they try to register or log in to WhatsApp from scratch, they are seeing this message. Sorry, your version of the app is too old. So this video will be a follow up fix and a new method. Now to fix this issue using the old method I shared in my previous video, where we installed Exotool tweak to fix it after downgrading WhatsApp to a certain version. I assume that Exotool tweak is already installed. Go to settings, scroll all the way down and you will see Exotool here. Simply tap on it and you will see this version right here. Simply change it to 2.25 dot 14 dot 77 then simply hit this button and then hit yes then go back go home now open whatsapp continue simply type in your number next yes now you can simply get the code to the number you entered enter it here and log in and you can see that there is no no error you can see it worked without issues you can see no issues whatsoever, no issues with connecting. Let me close it from the switcher and reopen it to show you that it works. You can see if I open a new chat, there are no issues whatsoever. You can see the message is also delivered. Now, if you ask me for me, the version we changed in Exotil is working fine for me. But if you have issues, you can close WhatsApp out completely. Go to settings, scroll all the way down to Exotil and change the version again to 2.25.8.74. Then hit this button, hit yes, go back open WhatsApp again and it will work no issues while connecting also. Just a friendly reminder that in the future, if you again see any login issues or WhatsApp usage issues, you can again try to go to Exotil and change the version here to see if it works. And if in the future an issue occurs, you can find the working version in the pinned comment of this video and also in the pinned comment of the full video of the previous method. Now let's discuss the method 2 which is easier which does not involve installing App Store Plus Plus and downgrading WhatsApp or installing Axotil. For method 2 we will delete WhatsApp completely to show you that it works. I will also go to Celio and remove Axotil and App Store Plus Plus then restart Springboard. Once we are back, first of all, of course, your device needs to be jailbroken. The jailbreak guides are in the description for both camera and check ring. Now let's go to App Store and search for and install the last compatible version for the WhatsApp Messenger. Simply hit on download and you will get the last compatible version and we will wait for the installation to finish. By the way, all the time, my date and time is the current one. I did not use any date method. All right, as you can see, WhatsApp is now installed. And now, of course, if I open WhatsApp, I will definitely see that it will say that it is no longer supported and the older versions of iOS are not supported. Simply open the switcher and close it. Open Celio. First things first, you are jailbroken with camera. Go to search and search for libhooker and you will see libhooker common. Simply install this package and it will also install all the related packages. And if you are jailbroken with checkrain, install substitute instead and for both jailbreaks go to search and search for preference loader and install this package now go to sources and then first of all add the big boss repo mostly it is not added when you jailbreak with camera to add it you can simply hit this plus button simply type it here and then hit add source now from the big boss repo open it go to all categories and search for wa 
legacy all right and you will see this package simply tap on it you don't get queued and confirm to install this package then restart spring boot by the way there are no options to configure in settings as you can see it right here for this tweak now open whatsapp you will no longer see any error message continue allow and simply type in your number here hit next yes you can see it worked without issues no errors whatsoever now here simply type in the code sent to your phone number type it here and log in now simply set it up as usual all right we are in you can see chat works without issues no errors whatsoever and the messages gets delivered some people reported that on ios 14 notifications are not working for whatsapp the fix is very simple first of all go to Celio, then go to sources and make sure you have the opa334.github.io repo added open it go to all categories and from there First of all, install this package called Choicey. Once this package is installed, you can head to the description or the pinned command. You will have to install this package called WhatsApp or WA Send Fix. It is a dev package. You can simply get it and then simply share it to seal you. Then get queued and confirm to install this package. Then restart Springboard. Once you go in, first of all, open settings. All the way down, you will find Choice C. Open it. Now, simply go to applications. Then here, search for WhatsApp. Open it. Then hit custom tweak configuration. Select allow. From there, enable WA send fix. Now simply hit app plugins. From there, go to notification extension, then disable tweak injection, go back. Then go to share extension and disable tweak injection, go back. Then hit service extension. Then hit custom tweak configuration. Now simply set it to allow. From here, also enable WA send fix. Now simply go back, go back again. Now simply go back. Now at this point, let's test the notifications. So I will close WhatsApp even from the switcher and try to send message from another phone. You can see I'm getting the notifications just fine. And same is the case on the lock screen. No issues whatsoever with the notifications. And when you open it, you can see no problems whatsoever. As we are discussing the second method and if even after this your notifications are somehow not working what you can do is you can install x hotel you can go to celio go to sources add this source mac themes dot me and from there you can try to install x tool for whatsapp which will surely fix your notification problem that's all for this video guys if you still have questions please ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care of yourself